Hello and welcome to the Armada Animations Quest plugin demonstration for Uni RPG, which is an editor extension for Unity 3D. When you install the plugin, you'll find that there's an additional tab called Quests. In here, we have the ability to add a quest, which we're going to do, called Dave. And we can see that there are three boxes that come up. There's a description, there's notes, they're pretty self-evident if you've used Uni RPG before. I can say whether the quest is available, I can say the number of completion calls that are required, I may have to kill ten orcs, I think I've got ten. Uh, I put the introduction test text, I put in the uh, continuation text, the hand in text, completion text, these are all tabs. Uh, I can add items as rewards. I can add a currency as a reward, or I can add even effect and attribute like experience as uh, uh, as a reward. They obviously you get them at the completion of this quest. We actually have one here. We've got uh, get the box, which has all these things filled in, including uh, two items, 100 gold and 100 experience on completion. In order to use these, you find your actors or items, in this instance an actor, to show the quest dialogue and Amada Animations quest. Uh, the player is the person who's interacting and we put the quest as get the box. The box itself is here and it uh, needs to have a pickup which calls it as a quest object, Amada Animations quest object. It itself is the quest object and it uh, is the quest for get the box. Uh, I've also, in this instance, also made it an untargetable quest object under Armada Animations untargetable quest object uh, for get the box, which means that until you get that quest, it won't be able to be picked up. This is so that uh, the player doesn't pick up the box and then go and get the quest. She tells me to go and get the box and I'll accept it. You also notice that if uh, I go and talk to her again, she'll say the continuation text. I'll do it again, she'll ask me again to go box. I've now gone and gotten the box. And when I come back and talk to her, she's quite happy because I've completed the quest. I talk to her again, she'll also say thanks for getting my box before. And that's what she'll say from now on. Okay. We'll also notice that she has given me the items. You can see here that she gave me a sword and a shield. Uh, she's also given me a hundred experience, which is very nice for a pretty simple quest, and a hundred gold pieces, which is also very nice. Obviously, that would not be a quest you'd use in the game, uh, but uh, it just demonstrates just how the quest plugin works. I'd like to give a big shout out to Leslie for his help in coding this, and uh, wish you all the best of luck. Uh, this will be available on the Unity Asset Store in the near future.